With the five-year, $245 million extension, the 33-year-old quarterback is now under contract with the Broncos for the next seven seasons. U.S. District Judge Aileen M. Cannon has signaled she is inclined to appoint a special master, but will decide after hearing arguments from Trump's lawyers and the Justice Department. After nearly two months since the last named storm, Tropical Storm Danielle formed Thursday morning in the mid-Atlantic, and the first hurricane of 2022 could soon follow, according to the National Hurricane Center. A pair of fiery speeches inside packed gymnasiums over the past week left even some White House aides surprised at President Joe Biden's newfound sense of electricity. House of the Dragons co-showrunner Miguel Sapiknik is parting with the show just as it's beginning to take off, but he doesn't plan on leaving HBO just yet. Russian President Vladimir Putin is to miss the funeral of the last Soviet leader, Mikhail Gorbachev, denying the man who failed to prevent the collapse of the Soviet Empire the full state honors granted to Boris Yeltsin.